searching for snakes in the Never Never Country, just south of Catherine, and I'm using a number of strategic approaches to locate snakes. Feeling the temperature of the ground, looking at the shadows that cast throughout the landscape, and studying the soft sand for fresh tracks. I've spotted a large scale market on the red soil, and begin tracking this snake down for the thick scrub country. In under an hour of tracking, I finally found him, a large black-headed python. Okay, here we have, here we have, there's a black, there's a black-headed python, and he's a harmless species, but he will, he will occasionally give the odd whack. Now, a special characteristic of this snake, you'll notice, is he's got a nice light and brown contrast all up to his head. And it's for a purpose. You see in the scrub, very, very hard to find, particularly here along the leaf litter. But what these little guys will do is they'll stick their head out, either from a termite mound or a log or a little rock crevices. And just by his head being black, he can absorb enough heat to heat up his entire body. The special little adaptation of this guy. That way, no birds from above can see him. No eagles, nothing can harm him. He's absolutely gorgeous. You can see it's about 40 degrees heat. And I could see some of his tracks out there through the sand. I knew I was, I was honing onto a snake. What species, I wasn't sure, but there we go. A black-headed python. Right here in the Northern Territory. This snake is most often found crossing roads late at night, whilst in the daytime he is rather conspicuous, hiding in soil cracks, abandoned burrows and tree hollows. Sometimes it can be quite a hard snake to find.